what is up everybody monster jet fanatic here and today i have a really awesome video somewhat of a special video too uh you're joining me outside instead of in my room in the studio right now just because it is really nice outside and you know why not sometimes I, i'll record outside this is definitely not the first time i've done it i do it here and there but i got this really really cool box from my buddy zona monsters maximudio you guys may know him especially off instagram he's been making a lot of reels on instagram he's got a bunch of followers on there but he also has a youtube channel and he's also a really big collector uh recently he's starting to sell off some of his collection so um i bought some stuff off of him because he had some stuff that i really wanted and i got six trucks but this was a bonus here and he threw this one in for free now for the ones that understand uh how special this is to me what you're looking at right now i respect you because you are an og you definitely have watched a lot of my videos before because often i'll talk about how i only need one truck between current and mix one so mix one to current day in main lines i only need one truck and i've always said that one truck is the mix 18 higher education and i've been saying that for months now because i think um beforehand i think i only I, the last one i needed was the mix uh seven or mix eight blue thunder and i got that one i think last year it may have been the beginning of this year but regardless i've had that for months now so for a while it's just been this truck truck right here that I have needed it's just a little variant with the yellow rims and the gray chassis but I needed it and he threw it in as a bonus now some of you guys are probably like finally he has one most of you guys are probably like okay but I really have been talking about this for a while and it also has the wheelie bar as you can see um, I forgot about this accessory this is like the time we still got accessories isn't this the last year we got accessories I believe it was um, I'm not completely sure I think we may have gotten a crush card in the next year in 2022 honestly I cannot remember but obviously it still has the wheelie bar which is cool so i have every single wheelie bar from 2021 as well so it was cool that he threw this truck in for completely free now for the rest of these trucks i spent 120 dollars on and there are seven trucks i know i said six at the beginning but there are six monster machines and then one hot wheels monster jam that i will be opening today and the and the hot wheels monster jam truck that i received from him we'll, we'll show it right now i actually had this one this exact one and i sold it to him not realizing i needed it so i bought it back for him he didn't charge me any extra than what i charged him for it ten dollars so i was happy to get this one so here is the jurassic attack this is the one from 2004 the tan metal base i could have sworn i had this one but i didn't so here is the back really cool series on the back grave digger great by jurassic attack obviously black stallion you guys can see all the cool ones on the back the purple tmnt i love that one so really cool series really cool era of trucks and, and when it comes to the back here this i think is the last one i needed from the back here i need one variant of that monster mutt right there with the uh, light fur variant i have the no fur variant and then the dark fur variant um so they made three i thought they only made two but they just made so many variants back then but here's the jurassic attack i am going to open it again this is the exact one that i had in hand like a month ago and here it is again because i needed it so that was stupid on my part but thank god it didn't cost me anything i mean i i sold it for 10 and bought it for 10 i didn't lose anything so we're gonna put the higher education in the back because that just it needs to be in the back of this whole video so let's get this out of the box 2004 guys the year i was born so this truck has been in the package for 20 years and we just take it out of the box right now see honestly i thought this did not come with the truck because i was at a flea market and i saw this i was like no way i just bought this back for my friend and it didn't have the back thing on it and most of the time when i see these trucks loose they don't have this back piece so i just started to assume that they didn't come with this back in the day but here it is it does have the back piece it's just those ones are broken <laughs> whenever i see them so here's the tan Jurassic attack obviously the metal base as you can see i love the chrome wheel they did the chrome wheels a little different back then there's like a little like black haze to them and i like that um it doesn't look like the same chrome that we got on the later castings for hot wheels monster jam only like the metal bases had this like cool color in the chrome it just looks like there's black around the, the pistons and stuff it looks really cool so there is the jurassic attack we're gonna put that next to the higher education so those are the two trucks that i will have loose everything else is carded and is going to stay carded i got some really awesome monster machines he had a really cool monster machine collection too i bought basically everything i needed from him monster machine related except the uh triple b trucks that he had i think he had like one or two because i'm gonna try to get all 11 of those for my birthday after today i have 30 or 31 trucks from monster machines 
And once I get those 11, I'll have like 42. And I think they only made like a little over 50. So I'm really crossing them off left and right. So with that said, I'm going to get into what I got from the Monster Machines. Let's see right here. First off, we have the Mighty Monster. So when I was in Hagerstown, Maryland for the uh, Monster Truck Invasion show last summer, they had this and one other truck I can't really remember um, for sale. And I didn't even look at it because at the time I didn't really. It was kind of overwhelming whenever I thought about collecting all the Monster Machines. But now here I am actually collecting them. And, you know, now I'm crossing them off the list now i have more than i need so i only need like 20 to 25 now so that's really cool i'm gonna try to get them all but i know some are canadian exclusives here's the back i like the tank on the back that's really cool so there is sergeant wait it says the mighty bus so is the other one sergeant smash it says the mighty monster bus i don't know i'm confused i think they made a sergeant smash monster machine too the teammate to the mighty bus but this one is really cool i don't know why they had it for sale in hagerstown because neither this truck or the sergeant smash truck or whatever was there so that was pretty cool to see but i should have gotten it but you know what i got it here so if you think about it i paid 120 dollars for everything in here these monster machines alone will be 120 dollars. so i basically got the drastic attack for free and then the higher education was free regardless so i literally only paid for the monster machines really it was like 110 so i was actually getting a little discount with all the six but then um we made it 120 with the drastic attack so that's how it went and then again the bonus higher education so there is the mighty bus that is a really cool one i'm really liking how the lighting is looking on these trucks so now i'm going to show these two teammates but one at a time here's the next one we have the veteran this one competes in the toughest monster truck tour and i've always wanted to go to one of their shows but they just don't have any near me the nearest one's like in west virginia and that's like seven plus hours away from me that's farther from east rutherford for me so that i just can't do that for a toughest show but i've always wanted to go to one so i hope they have one even in maryland or like you know north carolina convenient to me or of course virginia which is where i live anywhere would be cool near me so i can actually attend one as long as it's like plus like three hours or less than uh, to me I'd, I'd go so here's the back this is a really cool one and at the bottom here it says their sacrifice our piece this is a really neat casting and it is a real life one all these monster machines are real life castings most of them are um all the ones that you're seeing in this video i believe are the mighty bus is a right truck that's all i know so there's the veteran on the trophy truck body at the top there it says uh palmia and uh you are never forgotten with the soldier on the top that is really cool and then there's the hood put that in the back there let's get the next one this is the teammate i believe to the veteran because they kind of have the similar theme going here this is the first responder also a real life truck and he actually got this one signed i did not know that um veteran was not signed but this one is and i love that a little bit of dust but there it is another trophy truck body there is the first responder i kept forgetting this one existed look at the flag going from the hood to the roof and then ending at the tailgate right there silver base gray wheels black bead locks black tires of course look at the painted grill that is really cool with the ford logo and the and the gray in it that's really really awesome i love this one i love 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 this one i love both of them and i love the packaging on them i love the red white and blue i think that's really going to add some really cool color onto my wall because i don't really have red white and blue themed trucks other than the superstore exclusive like the independence day exclusives or whatever um for the next one let's do this one this is the last two extreme truck i needed and i saw it when i went to two extreme in lucama north carolina but this truck doesn't perform anymore so i didn't really think about getting it but it's still a really cool one and now that i'm actually trying to collect them all i went ahead and got it even though i i don't know if it's considered retired but it's at least on a hiatus right now i'm sure it'll be back because this truck's been you know here and gone a lot in the, in the last few years so this is jekyll and hyde and i really do like this color on it um, i like the lime green so i really wanted to get it so here's the grill i'm very glad i got it the headlights are painted the grill is painted really cool detail on this one let's get a closer look you can see the, the guy right there says jekyll and hyde some really cool details the jekyll and hyde on the on the tailgate too really cool and then here's the back this one was not autographed but there's the back so this is a retired two extreme truck but probably going to be back like i said eventually yeah let's put mighty bush over here in the corner why not all right now the last two guys we we're gonna do Ooh, this one this one so i didn't get the orange one but i had to get the blue velociraptor i mean he had both but i just got the blue one for now um i may get the orange one eventually but look he has this sign i think twice by two different drivers so that's really cool um it could be the same driver this one is devin winfield and then uh who's that on the top guys you guys tell me i can't really tell but yeah here's the blue velociraptor i'm very glad to finally have this one again i don't have the orange monster machines but obviously we have the spin master one i have two spin master ones so yeah you can hardly even see the truck because of all the signatures on it that's really cool I'm a, i don't mind i like when they sign the back though um like somewhere around here but there's no area for this one to sign 
um like this one here oh wow look at jekyll and high is coming a little undone it's not a big deal but here as you can see it says driver autograph right there some of them have that and some of them don't so we have a uh, five out of six shown already and now here is one of my favorite ones here i really really like this one i've been wanting this one for so long guys this is the equalizer and this is the monster machines equalizer this was one of the first few monster machines that came out um this was first shown at the tnt unfinished business monster truck show and me and of course zona monsters too we love this truck so much i know he likes it too i love equalizer and i think i have every single equalizer variant they came out with two hot wheels monster gem ones and now we have the monster machines one and i was really worried that i wasn't going to get one because these this one sold out everywhere like this is the only monster machine that i know for a fact that sold out everywhere so i am very very happy and i feel very lucky to have this one because i don't really know who else has this truck but it doesn't matter now because i have it and i got it from a good buddy i helped him out saving up for a car hope you get one soon and i hope you guys enjoyed this video tell me if you guys collect the monster machines because i know i really didn't at first but now i'm really starting to do it more i'm trying to get them all i'm a real completionist if you can't tell by it, whenever you see my collection it's kind of crazy so once i started collecting the monster machines there was no turning back so that's where we're at right now and i hope you guys enjoyed please like comment and of course subscribe for more videos like this that is a really awesome view and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out